Hi darlings, how are you? This is gonna be for my Aries. And this is just a little midweek check-in. So let's see what messages we have for you. So Aries, this is for you. The Prince of Swords. There might have been some kind of shift in your environment, either work or love. And it seems like it might be love. This is the Three of um, Swords. This is a broken heart. Or some kind of sadness. But it usually has to do with love. Broken heart. Maybe someone else was involved. Something to that effect. Um, the Ace of Swords, this is either communication or mental clarity that you're going to have. In the past, you felt like there was abundance, but you don't feel that anymore. And that's just because you're sad right now. Um, the Four of Swords, you need to take a rest. You've been doing something a little too much and you really need to take a break right now. You've been working a little too hard. Take a break. Sit down, relax, take a walk, do something for you. The Tower. This is a little chaos and confusion, or maybe a lot of chaos and confusion, depending on how you view it. But something happened within your environment to cause some chaos and confusion. And the Princess of Pentacles, this might be energy in your environment, or maybe you're doing some serious thinking, manifesting, in regards to some communication, maybe some money in regards to finances. The Hierophant, this could be job or this could be a marriage. It could be either be a contract or a marriage. But there was some confusion. This was a big argument. This was a very big argument. And the Three of Wands. Um, this is you expecting everything is going to be okay. You know it will. You being patient. Patient. Shift in your environment. Something broke your heart. Could have been someone else being involved. But it caused a tall moment. There was communication. It was very... Um, the Princess of Pentacles... This could be an energy in your environment. This could be a Virgo, a Taurus, or a Capricorn. Um, I do have the Hierophant um, above this. It could be someone who is younger than you are. Uh, maybe it's someone that you're married to or in, in a long-term relationship. It looks like there was an argument. And um, now there's some peace and calm. So you're back on track. I got the Prince of Pentacles. I got the Six of Swords. You're feeling balanced and things have really calmed down in your environment and you found your inner strength. Got the strength card. So whatever took place, I don't know if the story played out the way I told you. But whatever happened, everything is calm now. And let's pull you a card from here. It's not bad, you know? Not bad. Word fight, no, really and truly. What's meant for you is going to be for you, no matter what. Anxiety.
worry or distress. The woman on this card is filled with anxiety, worrying about something that causes her a great deal of discomfort. Receiving this card upright may indicate that you are experiencing a time of increasing stress, perhaps even a situation that you find yourself brooding about much of the time. However, if you will notice the scene outside the window, the storm is distant and perhaps even moving away. Whatever is going on, this card is telling you to release the worry and let yourself relax. Brooding and fretting will never solve things. So trust in yourself and your process. When you live with a relaxed heart and mind, you're far more likely to receive the solutions that you seek. The affirmation for this card is, I let go of fear and worry. I assume the best and live in peace. All is well. Told you. You're going to find your strength and things will calm down. Man, look, it's part of life. A little up, a little down. But don't beat yourself up. Whatever you do. I love you. You take care of yourselves and I'll chat with you soon. Bye.